everybody and welcome back to a brand new episode today on Roblox. My name is Digi and today I'm going to be showing you guys one badge on Ultimate Custom Night RP. But before we get started, go ahead, like the video and subscribe down below to join the badge hunting squad. If you do all that, then you go ahead and use hashtag badge hunter down in the comment section to let me know you are part of the squad. Anyways, though, let's go ahead and get the posh pizzeria badge. I also just love the way this game is when it starts. <laughs> this is the best. It looks so amazing. It's always different every time. All right. Oh! Alright everybody, so anyways, we are in the game and ready to go. We got our magnificent duo here. We got the creeper and we got Mikey boy. But today, the badge we are gonna get together, you and I. I'm gonna show you and you're gonna follow along. But the badge is called Posh Pizzeria. And all it's got to say is time to add some, or time to play <laughs> some Scrabble. Do you love Scrabble? Because I don't. I do not love Scrabble at all. I'm terrible. I can only think of three letter words in the game of Scrabble. While everyone else is playing 20 long letter words. So let's go ahead and be posh about it. Anyway, so, so where you want to go is into the museum right here in the spawn. This is actually a pretty easy badge to get. So go ahead. Go in there, head down the stairs, just, actually these aren't stairs at all, they're just, <laughs> just tr big triangles. And head over to the big ball, ball pit, I can't speak today, maybe I need to talk like this, maybe. So head over to the question mark, question mark exhibit, where it says, um, what even is this thing? Looks like a prop that survived the last fire. Helpy has been using it as a fishing location for ages now. Oh my gosh. Anyways, all you have to do is jump right in, fall down this very crazy, trippy little tube, turn around, and you're going to see this. A beautiful game of Scrabble. And once you walk in here, you will get the posh pizzeria badge. Congratulations, <laughs> my little badge hunters. You are now officially an amateur word scrabble hunter. <laughs> Anyways, though, there's some nice Easter eggs hidden inside this badge. It says, trust no one. Oh dear, what does that mean? And then we've got blood, moon. What can also that mean? But also, this is the biggest one of them all. This is the one for all the marbles, ladies and gentlemen. It is... Do you, do you, do you mind, Mr. Creeper? Do you, can you please move? Move, please, please move! It says gallant, that, that's all it says, this gallant. Gallant BH, what does that mean? <gasps> badge hunter, I'm the badge hunter! No, I created the badge hunting squad. I am the badge hunter master. Gallant gaming is just Freddy who eats chicken all day. Okay, we're gonna talk normal now. <laughs> Oh my gosh. So, I guess this is a good reason to do your Duolingo lessons. Because then you can learn your words and do better than me. Also, I never want to play this game ever again. <laughs> anyway, let's go ahead and check out the badge morph. I'm saying that I wasn't part of the Scrabble game. It's okay though. It's okay. Alright, so right over here is the Posh Pizzeria. We've got this beautiful guy. We got El Chip. Oh, uh, music man. And then we got Funtime Chica. Let's. Mm, yes. Oh, look at that bird butt. Ooh. All right, let's see. So we got jaw open. Oh, there's two sets of jaws. Okay, why does a bird. No, 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 thank you. Eyelids. Eh, nothing really glowing. Ooh, I like the glowing. Uh, jump scare cupcake. Yeah. Oh my gosh. And then the mask. There we go. I think that looks great. Kids are gonna love this. It looks like a, a demigorgon though. <laughs> Wait a second. Animatronics are demigorgons. Are demigorgons animatronics? What does this all mean? Hey guys, it's me, Funtime Chica. I've got a nice cupcake and a nice spot. I like them. 
You know, I, I don't want to talk about that one. <laughs> that, uh, let's just pretend that never happened and never existed. So let's go ahead and check out the other badge morphs that are available to us. I want to become El Cheap because he likes tacos and I like tacos and he probably makes great burritos. El Chip is the best animatronic. He knows how to cook. He knows how to speak Spanish. He does his Duolingo lessons. He is the ultimate animatronic. Hola, mi nombre es El Chip. ¿Cómo estás hoy? ¿Te gusta comer nachos y salsa? ¿Eh? ¿Qué onda, güey? Mira esas cajas chiquitos con manos rojos. ¿Sos número uno? No, yo soy número uno. Ole! I feel like someone probably gave El Chip like a Mario accent. Like, let's go! <laughs> Yahoo! No, that's Italian. Anyways, the last one is Music Man. And, uh, you know, he does look kind of creepy with his, like, look at his legs. Oh, it's like a spider. I don't like spiders. But I hate bees the most. But let's go ahead and check out some of the stuff. Music. Oh! Oh, there we go! <laughs> yeah! Play the music! Play the music! So he doesn't really have a lot of animations. He just has a lot of words. And, uh, yeah, that's it. That's all he has. It's just words. That's <laughs> Which is fine, you know. Maybe... Oh, wait. Music Man and El Chip can have a mariachi band. And then they can... They can raise money for the, the kids who can't afford nachos and salsa. All right, so I want to make a huge shout out to the person who helped me find this badge. Their name is Lapis Bob Lazuli. They helped me find this badge the other day. So thank you so much for helping me find this badge, Lapis Bob Lazuli. Or I'll just call you Lapis Bob. <laughs> or just Bob. Whatever you prefer. But thank you so much, buddy. Again, for those who don't know, if you help me find a badge, I will then give you a shout out in the video of me getting the badge or showing the everyone else how to get it. So thank you again, Lapis Bobble Zuli, for helping me find this badge. What is, wait, what are the soul jars? Jars filled with the souls of past victims that got in a fight with Night Sky. The souls can be used for great evil if they get into the wrong hands. Or should I say the wrong glove? Eh, what? What is this? The original Blood Moon. This is the first design made of the character Blood Moon that appeared in the Night Sky event. The original design looked more like a Grim Reaper, hinting to what happened to Night Sky in the end of the event. Oh, that is so cool. Look at that. Oh, that's so cool. That, I would use that morph all the time. Holy moly guacamole. Hello, good sir. Do you have the finest apple juice? Let's see. Hello there, there, young traveler. Tra travel, travel Oh, yes. It's Lord Wingardium Leviosa. Not Wingardium Leviosa. Anyways, though. Hello there, young traveler. How can I help you? Uh, where is the please deposit badge? <laughs> the badge? What do you mean? You want to play as me? Yeah. <laughs> Don't you need permission, pre-mission, from me to play as me? How can I get pre-mission? <laughs> Look, I don't care that much. I will give you the badge if you help me out here. Help with what? See that tool there? It's the plush storage. I lost Bonnie's guitar in there somewhere. If you get it, you'll get the badge. Thank you very much. No problem. I don't know why he sounds like that. Anyways, let's see. Is it true? <gasps> oh. Dun, 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 and subscribe down below to join the badge hunting squad today. If you haven't already, 
go ahead and do so. I love you all. As always, stay awesome, stay cool. I will see you all in the next episode. Also, again, thank you, Lapis Bob Lazuli. All right. Anyways, bye-bye.